everyone. Uh, today we are unboxing the 2017 October Lux box. And I've gone ahead and unboxed everything and uh, it's all in my inventory and I'm actually wearing a few of the items. So the first thing that I'm wearing is the Bizum hair and uh, as you can see it has like a little pocket styler. So it just basically changes the sides that the braids are on, or no braids if you don't like that. Um, the only thing that I don't like about the hair, I think the hair is very nice and I do like uh, braids hair. I think it would be better though if it had bangs. I'm not a big fan of hairs that don't have bangs. <laughs> Um, the other item that I'm wearing is the Blueberry shirt, which I always love seeing what Blueberry comes up with for Lux box. Uh, of course there is a HUD here and it's got several options for different bodies, including the Maitreya and the two Slink bodies and of course the Beliza body. And I'm just going to change it to that color. And the next uh, part up that I have on is the Empire Shoes called Baby's Breath. So again, there's uh, options for Slink, Maitreya, and Beliza. And it's just a nice simple little um, wedge here, which I like. I feel like I don't have enough wedges in my inventory. <laughs> um, and then of course with Empire, you have all these different options that you can do on the shoe. Uh, I mostly change all the metals to silver. Uh, and there was actually an update for this shoe, so if you haven't gotten the update of the shoe, uh, just go ahead, reattach your HUD, and then hit the new hit the Empire again to get the new shoe. And uh, I'm gonna wait on the Ison dress because. Uh, you have a Le Fil Cassé top, so I'm just going to put on the top and then take off the blueberry top. Oh. This is nice and simple. There's a lot of cleavage. <laughs> um, I do like that when it first rises in, it's purple. <laughs> That is one of my favorite colors, and it does also have a uh, color change HUD. That's not, oh, there it is. <laughs> so I'm assuming that you can change the actual shirt part, like where the black is and on the sleeves in this part. So let's do, yep, that's exactly what happened. Oh, so you can change it so it fits every, so everything is, matches the same color. And that's actually really nice. It is a really nice looking shirt. And I'm going to move on to the Paper Arrow Company sh uh, sweater because, um, that is also just a shirt. There are no bottoms in this um, this round. Oh, ooh, I like this shirt. I like the little heart. I wonder if I can use this for role playing. <laughs> of course, there's a HUD for this shirt. I love Paper Arrow Company. I think their meshes are very nice, and I love that there's different options that you can use. Um, I'm actually, I'm going to apply the, uh, the Annie socks from NX Nar Narcotics. I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong. I have problems pronouncing things wrong. There, with this, there's several options. Of course, there's a HUD. So we'll put the high ones on just because I have my high feet on. Uh, this one was actually a late item, so if you didn't receive it yesterday on the 15th and um, go ahead reattach the HUD and then get the um, the socks again. Um, 
It's just a nice, simple sock. Oh, it looks like there are little Halloween-ish. So I'm just going to pop that there, see if that works. Let's see, let's see. I'm, I'm wondering if these will work with uh, shoes, because I know certain socks you can't wear it with shoes, and other socks you can, so I'm actually going to put the, the Empire shoes back on. Oh, <laughs> there's a stripe. Oh, okay, I guess not. I guess these don't work with shoes. <laughs> well, that was a good learning experiment. <laughs> Oh, finally the HUD resident for the sweater. I actually like the the colors that are in um, in this round. Uh, let's move on to the moon here. Now for me, moon is a hit or miss. Sometimes it works on me, sometimes it doesn't. And let's just do an erratic. Oops. <laughs> Did it work? <sighs> Is it changing colors? Oh no, it's just resing it. I actually am a big fan of ponytails. Only because I like wearing ponytails in real life. Even though my hair is very short that I can't wear a ponytail right now. So, uh, because the HUD didn't resin, I don't know what color this is going to be. So, this will be a uh, very interesting thing. And now I'm finally going to put on the Ison, uh dress. I like that. I like that the top looks like it works with the skirt. Um, the description said that this was a bodycon dress. So let's see. It's, um, I love ice on too. Julie V cut bodycon. Of course, there's options for the slink bodies and the Maitreya, and then, of course, the HUD, like always. I actually don't mind that. I like. The hair actually matches pretty well with the dress. <laughs> well, while that's resing in, I'm going to res out the uh, the tart cape wagon. There's, uh, It's an adult version, so there's, uh, there's also a version with lights and with no lights. Oh! down a bit. I'm not exactly sure what you would use this for. I like Tart. I think she's got some nice items. I have quite a bit from her, but usually from mostly from Luxbox. <laughs> Let's see, prop. I like the lights on it. Seems like you could mostly use this if you wanted to do a photo of like a hayride kind of thing. This is nine landing packs, so not very bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. And I'll just keep that up. And I do actually really like this dress. I got a couple of blog posts I need to do, and I think this one could be <laughs> pretty good for it. Um, then, you know, next up I'm going to show the Scarlet Creative, the Ministry. This, <laughs> this is supposed to be a foam box. And... Uh, she has 15... Quick 
Um, it comes with different uh, colors. So I'm actually going to res out the red one because that is what is described in the book. And there's actually one for Dr. Blue. <laughs> so if you're a Doctor Who fan, then um, there you go. You have your own phone booth for um, cruising around the galaxy. Okay. So it says just go open this to use the phone. You pop you pop in the box and click the magical phone book. Select the ministry and then you can sit to TP. Towards your bookcase. Okay. Target. Ministry. Where did I land? Oh! <laughs> this is kind of cool! I'm not sure where I landed, but this is actually kind of cool. I think I might actually use this for my new vlogger box. <laughs> I like this a lot. <laughs> Target. Telephone. And then you can turn the same way. <laughs> that is pretty cool. Now I want to know what the Dr. Blue one looks like. Red. Take this one. Okay. Six two four four two. For anybody who doesn't know, um, in Harry Potter, that is the. Oh, it does the same thing. I thought it would be like one would be like Harry Potter, and the next one would be like Doctor Who or whatever. Oh, and this didn't resonate quite the same. Okay, so you're stuck in here. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so I'm going to move on and do the June Maitreya bodysuit. I hope that maybe everything will turn out correctly. There you go. Uh, dum. Go. I always think whenever I look at bodysuits, I feel like they look like bathing suits instead. <clears throat> this is no exception. This does look like a bathing suit. Uh, the one last thing that we have left is Jin Skull Pup. Sugar Skull Pup. So there's a companion and a hold option as well as a wanderer. I would be cautioned about wanderers in case you live on a um, parcel and it's like against the um, covenant. So just be very careful. I'm just waiting for these you think so? <laughs> That's so cute. Okay, well it's not resing in. Animation sound resize. Oh, animation sound resize name. Oh, you can name the companion. That's so cute. Oh, there it is. Okay, that is actually very cute. So I'm going to leave myself in this skybox that I can't seem to get out of. So this has been the October um, 2017 Lux box. 
So uh, I hope everybody has a good day and a good start of the week. Bye.